I'm headed for nothing, no turn into something from nothing, yeah Made it through poverty, on our minority, you yeah. start Hop on the jet on my property and fly away Fly, fly, fly away, yeah. Call me a present, yeah, yeah. Straight out of the trenches, yeah, yeah. My niggas can't wait, yeah, yeah. The riches, the riches, the riches, yeah Rich Jim Fit Check This top, prosies I think the color is navy blue Yo Real shorts. I believe these are the Dora edition. And it has like the little scrunch in the back. I love the lines on the side. And I believe this is like the burnt orange color. These Nikes, I don't know the name of them. And my Gymshark socks. I really like this color combo, like the dark blue with the dark orange. It's giving. And the body is giving too. Yeah, but we got hamstrings today. Well, you know the deal, glutes, but it's hamstring focus. That's what we have today. So we're gonna get, we're gonna eat our breakfast and take our vitamins. These are our supplements of the day. We have Metaburn. This is an advanced metabolism booster. It's supposed to maximize fat loss, all day energy, appetite support. It says you're supposed to take two, but I'm like really, really low on them inside. So I've just been taking one a day. And then I take Embrace, this woman's hormonal balance. Like, you know, get your hormones together, improves complexion, manages stress, increases libido. And if you're unfamiliar with what libido is, that's just like your sex drive, really. And then RF350, this is like a muscle builder. So it says greater muscle size, greater endurance, greater strength. I just take one of each lately. And then I take my multivitamin, my one a day multivitamin, and then vitamin D3, which is good for like your immune system and like your joints and all that. So I take those daily. And then for breakfast today, I have my overnight oats. I'm back to making my overnight oats because recently I've been eating like my oatmeal like done in the microwave and stuff like that. But I missed my overnight oats. So this one has like peanut butter, chia seeds, not peanut butter, but the peanut butter protein powder. Chia seeds, water, a dash of salt, cinnamon, and a Biscoff cookie on top, too, too good. So that's gonna be my breakfast before my workout. Okay, y'all. Y'all already know the drill. I said it once and I'm going to say it again. Always do your dynamic warm ups. You want to make sure you open up your hips, warm up them joints because we do not want to be out here causing injuries on our body when you know we're trying to get fine for the summertime now this one i recently just started doing where i'd get into i believe it's called a pigeon pose don't quote me and i rock back and forth because i'm trying to open up my hips one of my hips feels really really st has been feeling really stiff lately so this has been helping like alleviate it and y'all already know my favorite little hamstring stretch these walk-in sweepy things okay after that let's get into our first exercise first runner up we got hip thrust i like to do a warm-up set my warm-up set is going to be 225 for 12 reps now i love to perform hip thrust because it targets your gluteus maximus and basically that is the entire glute 
Once we finish our warm up set, now we're gonna go ahead and up the weight and start working on our working set. For my first set, I'm going to be doing 315. I believe I performed this set for eight to 10 reps, I'm not quite sure. But you wanna make sure you kinda have like a wide stance with your toes pointed outward and you want to do a hinge motion at the hips and always keep your chin tucked and raise your hips like extend them upward so that you can make sure you are targeting your glutes here i am before my sets most of the time i like to do a practice set and as you can see for my second set i went ahead and up the weight i added 25 on each side so basically that is 365 if i'm not my wrong because you know your girl be mind boggled sometimes but as you can see i'm still keeping my form intact even though i up the weight be sure you can always progressive overload but make sure your form is always in order you do not want to compromise your form next exercise we got stiff leg rdls basically you want to keep your legs as straight as possible keep that back flat and i want you to push that butt out and actually feel that stretch in your hamstrings. Now, as you guys can see, I am standing on a platform and the reason is because I want to have more of a stretch when I go down. So basically it is a deficit stiff leg RDL. As you guys can see, you can see my hamstrings are engaged. You can see them coming out as I perform the movement. I also want you guys to see like the type of grip I have. I have like the mix match grip. I feel like that is the best grip for me because with this grip, I can actually pull more weight and that can be with my rdls my deadlifts my sumo deadlifts it does not matter next exercise we have is the single leg hamstring curls i love to perform this exercise on this specific machine so basically you want to curl your leg up damn near touching your glutes or touching your glutes and you want to use a lighter weight and perform higher reps so that way you have more control over the weight. And the rep scheme I used was 15 reps. My hamstring curls are a top tier exercise and has helped my hamstring growth so much. And like I always say, it's the kickstand of the booty. Like that's what's gonna help lift it up. So if it's not in your regimen for your glute and hammies day, I highly recommend you add them. But that about wraps up this video. We got a little tangerine booty going on and I absolutely love it. So if you like this video, don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. And until the next one, peace.